This video is sponsored by Shower Hair. Hey guys, it's me, Squawker, and today I have- I'm gonna combine two book reviews, and I've been stalling these because I could not find the second book within the two books I will be talking about. The first book I will be talking about is Library Souls, and the second one I will be talking about is Tales of the Peculiar, and this is the very nice paperback edition. So without further ado, let's get into these two. So, the first one I'm going to be starting off with is, is Library of Souls. Both of them are by Ransom Riggs, and this is the third and final book within the Miss Peregrine's trilogy, and it essentially is the last book, and it is the conclusion of- oh look, I still have my bookmark in here. Um, it is the last book within the Miss Peregrine series trilogy, and basically it's the conclusion- I think I just repeated myself- it's the conclusion of what happens within the- trilogy um we find that jake eventually does go back home um and they are still trying to save the umbrens which consists of a lot of people and they defeat the um what are they called baba like the oh my god it's like I could think of it, but like, I don't know like the actual name of it. Comment down below so that way I could be like really stupid and remind myself like, oh yeah, that's what they're called. But, um, so yeah, um, I really did and I fairly enjoyed this book. It felt awkward because I did this on audiobook and I didn't necessarily have the, um, what's it called? I didn't have the pictures to look off of and so like every time I would like hear something with any audiobook I'm like there's probably a picture for that and I am missing it and so it felt really awkward and I think that's the reason why I did lower a rating to you guessed it three out of five stars um essentially it's just that I didn't fairly enjoy this um I feel like the ending if anyone else watches American Horror Story I think they can relate to this I felt like the ending was like almost every series finale off of American Horror Story because like you have an ending and you think it's gonna end right there but then they decide to take it further and like try to make the most of it and you're just like no it shouldn't no it shouldn't end like that and basically that's how I felt for this series I felt like it could have ended a certain way but I did like how um the gang all came back together and they're like, yes, we are real. And honestly, Jacob's parents are honest, like, they're dicks, along with, like, the therapist and stuff. And the fact that, like, they went through his privacy. Privacy is, like, a really big thing for me. And if someone were to invade my personal stuff, I would get very offended by it. And so I just don't think, especially with Jacob's, like, overall, like, condition at this point, that they shouldn't be invading that kind of privacy and so because that's like the only thing that they like he remembers and like it's the only thing that makes him happy and the fact that they just invaded it made me really mad and I felt like the parents kind of like got it in the end so yeah so I rated this a three out of five stars and the next and last book I will be talking about before I film my series wrap up right after this is Tales of the Peculiar by Ransom Riggs and over the course throughout the second and the third book they mention the Tales of the Peculiar which is like a bunch of short stories that the gang reads like over the course of the two books within the trilogy it's not really mentioned in the first one I think I'm not sure but essentially that's what it is and can we all just talk about this cover the reason why I wanted to get the paperback of this one is because the covers are so pretty and the hardback one is it just looks dull and so I was like I need to get the paperback version and when I saw the cover of the paperback I'm like oh I'm saving my money of it and so I bought this yesterday and oh yeah by the way today is Sunday February 3rd 2nd I don't know but yeah so basically it's just like a whole bunch of short stories and if I could turn to the table of contents oh yeah by the way the foreword is you have the publisher and then the actual four is by Millard, which I thought was super cute. And they don't have a table of contents, which is kind of making me mad because I feel like they should. So, oh, here we go. So you have the forward, you have the splendid cannibals, you have the fork tongue princess, the first Yembrin, the woman who benefited ghost, Coco Bolo, pigeons of St. Paul, the girl who contained nightmares, the locust, the locust, the locust, I don't know. Um, the boy who can hold back the seed, the tale of the 
Cuthbert, and the man who bottled the sun. Probably my favorite one out of this was the girl who contained nightmares because she just had like this hidden talent and like she couldn't really like show it and like she cur cured her patients, well his her dad's patients and I just found it very relatable at some points and they still have illustrations in here. I just think the illustrations are like very different from the um like here is the one from the boy who can hold back the sea like that's freaking gorgeous and I need a coloring book of these. ASAP, but they still have some illustrations in it. Um, I think the illustrator in these is Andrew Davidson and um, He also did the wood engravings for the Iron Man And that's about it. And then you have friends and rings So I rated this a 3.5 out of 5 stars because I did fairly enjoy this and I felt like this was like a nice little like ending of the trilogy and Yeah, so I liked it. So yeah, um, those are my two book reviews mashed into one video of uh, Library of Souls and Tales for the Peculiar by Ransom Riggs. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. What are your honest opinions about, like, the whole trilogy? Because, like, I feel like at this point, like, it's not really, like, well known anymore, nor do I feel like it's gonna get another movie because... Like, when I was reading Library, not Library, um, Hollow City, like, they kind of combined the ending with that, and so I was like, uh, that's kind of weird. So, yeah, my name is Gillian, I make videos every Tuesday, and another video whenever I can, and yeah, I will see you guys next time.